Hello and welcome back to Nerd Doc. Netflix was definitely good to Cobra Kai fans this year, releasing season 4 and season 5 less than 9 months apart. Unfortunately, that won't be the case for season 6. In fact, Cobra Kai season 6 could be the longest wait between seasons since the series made the jump from YouTube to Netflix. This video breaks down when you can expect to see Cobra Kai season 6 and why the wait will be longer than most are expecting. Plus, we also take a look at the plot for the next Karate Kid movie and those pesky Cobra Kai movie rumors. There are chapter timestamps, so you can jump around the video as you wish, and if you have any questions or release date theories of your own, leave a comment below. Don't forget to check out our other Cobra Kai coverage, including our predictions for the plot of Season 6. Late last year, the creators of Cobra Kai signed a new four-year deal with Sony Pictures TV, the production company behind Cobra Kai. While part of this new contract will see the creative team brainstorm Cobra Kai spinoffs and movies, similar to how Sony handled the Breaking Bad franchise, it also includes the new action comedy series Obliterated. The minds behind Cobra Kai are currently filming the Obliterated series, which won't wrap principal photography until November. According to Cobra Kai co-creator John Hurwitz, the team hasn't even begun writing season 6 of the series yet, and they won't start that process until after filming on Obliterated has been completed. When you factor in post-production for the Obliterated series, as well as the holidays, the scripts for Cobra Kai Season 6 probably won't be completed until well into 2023, with production beginning around the middle of the year at the earliest, although the second half of 2023 seems more likely. So what does all this mean for the release date of Cobra Kai Season 6? At best, we're looking at the series being ready to go around March of 2024. But keep in mind, once filming and post-production are done, Netflix may still hold on to it until a good release window is available. For instance, if we look back at Cobra Kai Season 5, it finished filming last December, with most of the post-production completed by March or April, but Netflix didn't release it until September. Without knowing more about what Netflix has scheduled for 2024, it's difficult to pin down a probable release date beyond mid to late 2024, but at the very least, we're looking at nearly a two-year wait. But don't worry, Cobra Kai fans, because there is some good news on the horizon. We mentioned earlier that Sony has plans for more Cobra Kai after what will likely be the sixth and final season. The creators have discussed a spin-off show, and there's been talk of a Cobra Kai movie as well. We already made a video about our theories for a spin-off show, but a movie would directly pick up after the events of the Cobra Kai series finale. Keep in mind, nothing has been officially greenlit just yet, but it would be absolutely shocking if Netflix cancelled the series now or didn't want more Cobra Kai after the series finale. Just as a warning, there are Cobra Kai Season 5 spoilers ahead if you haven't already seen it. One of the best routes for a Cobra Kai sequel movie would be to follow Anthony LaRusso or Johnny and Carmen's currently unborn child. It allows a new story to be told while still keeping Daniel and Johnny in play. Of course, that can also be done by following Sam and Miguel, perhaps after they have been married, but that depends on how long the wait is between the final season of Cobra Kai and the release of the movie. If we aren't getting season 6 of Cobra Kai until, say, the second half of 2024, that means the movie is unlikely to happen until at least 2025 or maybe even 2026 and beyond. There are a number of avenues to explore, but it's very likely a movie is on the way at some point. The only question is how old are the characters by the time the movie comes around, and what storylines would they be following? The movie would probably land on Netflix, but since Netflix doesn't technically own Cobra Kai, there is a slim chance it ends up on another streaming service, especially if it has a theatrical release first, which is possible. In oddly unrelated news, Sony is actively working on a new Karate Kid movie that will not be connected to the Cobra Kai series. While no official details have been revealed, there are some very reliable rumors that have been circulating around the internet. Before you get too excited, remember this is the same studio who brought you Morbius and treats most of its franchises like cheap dates. The new film looks to be much more like the Jaden Smith Karate Kid movie rather than any of the Ralph Macchio films. While it probably won't actually be called Karate Kid Part 4, it's being written by Rob Liber, whose main writing credits are Peter Rabbit and Goosebumps 2 Slappy's Revenge. Doesn't that just scream quality script to you? If that weren't enough bad news, the new movie is said to feature a teenage boy from Beijing, 
who moves to New York and ends up teaching Kung Fu to a friend's father before being drawn back into the ring himself. You heard that right. It's Kung Fu instead of karate, and it's basically the Jaden Smith movie, only with the roles reversed, and as of right now, has no connection at all to Cobra Kai. At least Jaden won't be in this one. Hopefully. Sony is probably trying to strike while the Cobra Kai iron is hot, but having the Cobra Kai people handle the next Karate Kid movie would be a much better idea than following the Jaden Smith model and hiring the same guy who wrote Peter Rabbit. Oh well, Sony's gonna Sony. How's that Craven the Hunter movie coming along? Anyway, all joking aside, what do you think the Cobra Kai sequel movie will be about? Are you upset that we'll have to wait until at least 2024 for the next season of the series? And what do you think about the next Karate Kid movie? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. For now, that wraps up this video. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and share with someone who really loves Morbius and can't wait for Craven the Hunter. Just kidding, share this with Cobra Kai fans.